For the Diamondbacks, the lefty Tommy Henry. D-backs Bob have won all three of Tommy's starts this year. Swing and a miss. There is the curveball, and there's the first giant strikeout against Tommy Henry. Lines it to center, Alec Thomas. Tommy Henry, only 10 pitches thrown in that first inning. One, two, three, go the Giants. On the hill tonight for the Giants will be the veteran right-hander, Alex Cobb. Line drive off of the glove, and they got him anyway. And somehow the Giants still got the out. That was pretty impressive. And he takes one off the inside, ball four. So there's your first Giants base runner. There's a guy to watch down the road for the Giants. A youngster they like an awful lot. It's rookie Casey Schmidt, just his third career start. High, deep down the line. It is out of here. Into the second deck. He just unloaded on that pitch. A towering home run, the second homer of his brand new big league career. And that one was demolished. And the count evens up at a ball and a strike. Base hit for Fletcher. It gets by Wade. Walker heads for third. He'll get there standing up. And they're on the corners with one out. Tied runs are on base for Gabby Marino. Chop to Schmidt. Can they turn it? That's one. And double play. So they kept the runner at first, kept the double play in order, and he got the ground ball. One and two the count to Tyro. Henry throws, and a curve hits him. Came down and hit him on the foot. And Estrada goes, and there's a throw down, and it's not in time. Stolen base number 11. And a fly ball. That might be trouble. Walker racing back, 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 and he makes a catch, and Estrada's got to hold it second. That was over the shoulder looking up, and he was able to glove the ball and hang on for out number two. J.D. Davis, Estrada on the move. Moreno's throw! Got him! Rojas applies the tag. Estrada runs into the final out at third. And J.D. Davis, if I'm him, I'm shaking my head back and forth, wondering why, when you're in scoring position, you take the bat out of my hand. Back to work goes Alex Cobb. He's given up three hits, each team with three hits. Bouncing ball to Schmidt. He will set and throw, and he's got a good arm. Swing and a miss, strike three. Splitter, nasty. So Smith goes down for out number two. It is hit on the ground to third. J.D. Davis has it, and he can take his time and throw all the way across to first to get Walker, and that's a nice one, two, three inning for Alex Cobb. On to the fifth we go. And the Diamondbacks trail it 2 nothing. Rookie Casey Schmidt, a two-run homer off Tommy Henry in the second. All the scoring so far. Each team with three hits. Ground ball back to the mound. Henry's got it. And he'll underhand the first to Walker to retire Wade. One out. Here goes Johnson. Strada lifts it out to right field. An easy play for Fletcher. And Johnson's got to hustle back. He was down on his belly at second and makes it back in time. A nice effort by the middle infielders for the Diamondbacks right there to decoy Johnson into believing there was a play at second base. He went in on his belly, but there's that speed getting back to first base. Johnson at first two outs to pitch. Popped up on the infield. Walker wants it, the first baseman. Fair territory, he makes a catch, and the side is retired. No runs. Rookie Casey Schmidt, a two-run homer in the second. All the scoring so far. Diamondbacks trail the Giants to zip as Lourdes Gurriel Jr. leads off the fifth against right-hander Alex Cobb. Here's a swing by Gurriel. Fly ball, right field. Not that deep. Conforto is there to make the catch. One away. That one is knocked down by the rookie shortstop who makes a tremendous play, but Wade can't corral it. Fletcher's aboard for the second time. That's Casey Schmidt down there filling in for the injured Brandon Crawford. Big chopper to third. Davis to Estrada. Another double play to end the inning. And Moreno's hit into two double plays. Just needs to just square one up, and I think he'll get it going after that. And Rojas punches it into left. A two-out single for Josh. And Marte into right field. That's a base hit. Rojas will stop at second. And the Diamondbacks got something going here. Two on and two out. Back-to-back -back hits. And the batter will be Pavin Smith. Gets a high fly ball to Michael Conforto. And that's going to end the inning. And that's out number three. Conforto <laughs> thought it was the second out. That's all you need. Just that's those it. three outs. Just three. Nine, six on the put out at second. And here is Lamont Wade Jr. Out to center, here comes Alec. Fletcher coming in as well. Alec Thomas in the gap. And Bart hustles back to first. That's out number two. Let's see how Torrey wants to play it. Here he comes. And let's give five stars to Tommy Henry, who did a very nice job tonight against a good giant ball club. So Henry will depart after six and two-thirds innings tonight. He gives up only five hits to two runs. 
And a bunt out front of the plate. Marino has it and then throws him out on a dandy play. Boy, this kid can play. I mean, sometimes as an offense, you have to recognize early on that this guy's on top of his game tonight. Guriel finds a gap. Lourdes, that's going to get all the way to the wall. He's got himself a stand-up double. Two men out, runner at second, the pitch down low. There goes the runner to third, and Guriel will get in. Heads up base running by Lourdes Guriel Jr. Bob furious with himself. That's his first walk tonight, and it comes with two outs in the seventh inning. And a two-ball, no-strike count. Cobb to the plate. Thomas, ground ball to second. Right there is Estrada, and he throws him out for out number three. What a job again tonight by Cobb. And ball four, he walked it. So a one-out base runner, and here comes Gabe Kapler. That's going to be the last pitch that Cobb throws, and what a night he had. Nicely done again, Alex Cobb. 0-2. Marte bounces right back to Rogers. He's going to throw to second. That's one. Schmidt to first. Got him double play. And that'll be a base hit for Davis to start the ninth. Draws the walk, and Casey Schmidt comes up with two on and nobody out. He swings here and hits a big chopper over third. Rojas playing in, and it rolls down the left field line. Davis around third. He'll score, speeding into second. Schmidt around the third. Conforto, it's 3 nothing Giants. And you get that one hopper over Rojas' head at third base. He did everything he can. Rojas even tried with the bare hand to feel, feel the ball over his head, but just out of his reach. There's a rocket up the middle for a base hit. One run's going to score. Schmidt will be held up. Bart with a solid single. It's 4 nothing. Wait up the middle. The throw is going to come home, and everybody's safe. Ball squirts away from Moreno. Now the throw will go down to second, and that's late. Alfonso Marquez. Arizona's challenging a safe call at second base. No, oh, I see what they're saying. They're saying that Perdomo had blocked him off. Is that possible? After review, the call stands. The runner is safe. Arizona will lose their challenge. Driven to left. This will be caught by Guriel. Sacrifice fly for Bryce Johnson. Six nothing. All right, you're looking for base runners here. He got two ones to start it off, and here comes Guriel. It's a little roller. Wade at first, and the runners move up. And another pitch on three and two. Base hit. Haven is home. Walker coming right behind him. Don't go anywhere. It's six to two. Two RBIs and three hits tonight for Dominic Fletcher. And Camilo getting loose here in a game that the Giants want to make sure they hang on to. Here's the pitch. Moreno strikes out swinging and his helmet flies off. What a slider from Camilo. Two down. Duvall with his ninth pitch here in the ninth. And that's the ball game. So Camilo Duvall comes in and makes sure this didn't turn into a more stressful ninth inning. And the final score, 6-2. to two.